Hey everyone, um, I had another dream again. I know it's crazy because it's like my third dream that I had, but this one, I don't remember everything in it. I remember um, just the most important thing in it. Um, I was somewhere, I'm not sure, I'm trying to make this short. Um, I was with this man, but before I was with the man, I was fighting other guys up in the dream. I was fighting big guys, small guys, you name it. And I was basically beating them all up and everything, but not to the point where, you know, uh, it's real bad. Um, I was basically just winning, you know, basically. And um, one of the guys saw my skills and he was asking about it. And I was telling him that I never had any training that I trained myself. And um, he was a tall, dark-skinned guy. And it was at some type of facility or um, some type of job or something like that. I'm not sure. Um, and I was talking to him. And it's crazy because when I was talking to him. Hold on just a second. When I was talking to him. I knew that I was in a dream. It's crazy because um, I was saying to him, like as I was talking to him, I was asking him questions about certain things, but I forgot what I was asking him. But I know I was saying to him that, um, cause he was busy. So I, I was telling him that I wanted to talk to you before, um, I wake up in this dream because I know I'm in this dream and I'm trying to talk to you before I wake up. And I literally said that in a dream. This is crazy. I never said anything like, anything like that or done any, anything like that before. I never knew that I'd be dreaming in a dream. I never knew that before. This is the first time I ever said it to anybody in a dream that I'm telling them that I'm in a dream. And I'm trying to talk to you before I wake up. That's, that's my first time ever saying that. But that's what actually happened. This is my first time that ever happened. So I know that um, by that happening, I know that I'm starting to um, realize that I'm dreaming now. Like, that's the, that's the um, awakening process. I know it is. That, that's the awakening process, basically. So I'm starting to realize that I'm in a dream now. But I got to start doing that even more so that way I can um, know what I'm doing and... Um, um, talk to people and everything, try to get information on how to, you know, um, get set free from this mess or something. So it's starting to work. I don't know what I've done, but I just, I guess I just knew. And I brung it into the dream and just said to uh, the person that, you know, I know I'm in a dream. And I'm trying to get information before I wake up. And that's exactly what I said to him. And he was working as I was talking to him. And... I was just asking him a lot of questions and stuff. And um, I know the dream was longer than that, but after, after I was asking him all these questions, I was asking him about, um, you know, the skills that I learned and everything. I wanted to have a trainer. Um, and what else I was saying? I was saying something about, I think, how to break free from this. And he just looked at me, and then I ended up waking up. And I, I don't understand why he just looked at me and not answer my question. But um, I realized I'm starting to wake up. Like um, I'm starting to fully awaken. I'm already awake. I'm starting to fully awaken. But by, by this happening, it's letting me know that I know that this is not reality. And that I'm starting to control my own dreams now. But I'm, I'm not controlling it to the fullest, but I'm starting to control it as in me knowing I'm in a dream. So that's a start. That's that's a good start. So I got to start keeping this up. Because, see, like, a lot of y'all, you know, say I'm evil and all this stuff. Not a lot of you, but just a certain person saying that stuff about me. And a lot of you don't even listen to my, you know, what I have to say. You know, y'all just stop watching my videos and everything. But y'all don't realize that the things that I'm going through, I'm still going through the same stuff. And I'm not a Christian. Y'all don't understand. I'm not a Christian. 
and uh, why, why, why am I going through these things, still and all, of what Christians, what they so-called go through? Why am I going through it, and I'm not a Christian? That's what I'm trying to get y'all to understand. I am not a Christian no more. So why am I still going through these things, seeing supernatural things, seeing um, me being somewhere else, like in a heavenly type place? Why am I still having these dreams, and I'm not a Christian? That's what y'all don't understand. I am not a Christian. I have no religion. So why am I still having these good paradise dreams still? Why is that? No one can explain it. Because y'all don't even know yourselves. Because y'all think you need a religion. You need to be a Christian in order to be free and believe in the Lord and believe in God and Jesus and everything to be free. I told you guys, the only way you be free is if you fight your way out of this. You have to you have to be awakened. If you're not awakened, you don't know the truth and you know nothing but lies, you're gonna keep coming back to this earth because you know nothing but lies and you're not awakened on top of that. You don't know who you are. So how could you expect to go somewhere? You don't know who you are and you're being taught lies. Because when you go to the other place, you ain't gonna know anything but lies. And you ain't even gonna know who you are. At least try to know who you are. But y'all still being programmed into this mess they teaching you. You ain't gonna ever get anywhere. You're gonna keep coming back to this earth. That's the point of them keep corrupting you. I know I said, like I said before, that I was not gonna do this no more. But I'm keep having these dreams constantly. This is the third dream that I had that was different. You know, and well, this is actually my third dream in a row within the same week. And I, I don't understand why I'm having these dreams like crazy, but this is the only dream I ever had in my life that I told somebody in my only dream that I'm trying to get, I'm trying to talk to you before I awake. Well, I'm trying to get information from you before I wake, before I wake up because I know I'm asleep. I said this to the to this person, and. That never happened before. So I know that I'm I'm awakening. I know that's what this means. And y'all don't have to listen to anything I'm saying, but it's the truth. Um just a second. And my dog, he just won't listen to me. He be in the house for a while, so he don't, he don't wanna go back in. But um but yeah, I, I had a dream today, and I just want to let you guys know that, like I said, a lot of so-called Christians I always say they talk to God, they talk to Jesus, which they think is the same person and all that. Um, they, you know, they always say they go to heaven and everything. So I ask you all, why? Am I still having these heavenly dreams? And I'm not a Christian. And all the things that I speak of, I'm still having these dreams. I'm not hearing a voice saying that you're wrong. I'm not hearing a voice say, tell them this, tell them that. I speak to y'all. I'm telling y'all the truth about everything that I speak about. Because like I said to you before, knowledge comes from within. So by knowledge coming from within yourself, that information that you know within your soul, your spirit, your true self, is going to your brain. And you will know it yourself. It's like downloading, basically. Your brain is downloading information from your spiritual self, from within. And you gain that knowledge by getting all of that fear and negativity out of your mind. That's how knowledge will come from within and you will know these things automatically without reading the Bible because the Bible is not telling you everything that you need to know, that you're supposed to know, the truth. It's not telling you the whole entire truth. That's what I'm trying to get y'all to understand. Y'all thinking I'm saying there's no God. Y'all think I'm saying that the Bible is not 100% true. No, y'all y'all make it seem like I'm saying that the Bible is um. Um, 100 percent true when it, when it's not. I'm not saying that uh, I don't believe in the Bible. I'm just saying it's not 100 percent true. That's all I'm saying to you. 
you know, and I, I want y'all to understand. I, I might, I might have said that wrong, but y'all you know, get what I'm trying to say. But um, I just, I'm trying to awaken you guys to the truth. And once you have all this fear and negativity and all this stuff in your mind, you ain't gonna never know the truth. You ain't gonna never um have knowledge downloaded from within yourself to your brain so you can know these things like I know. This way, Chucky, come on. Um, you're gonna always be in that state of what they want you to live in. And that's what they want y'all to be. They want y'all to be stuck into the system of uh, uh, how they t uh, taught y'all all these things when it's not even true. Come on. I'm just trying to help you guys. I'm trying to make things better on this earth so we can all waken up. We can all waken and realize who we are and take control of this earth. This way, Chucky. Chucky. Come on. I'm just trying to help. I'm trying to awaken you guys so we can stop going through this mess. So that way I can go back to where I came from. Because I'm not from this earth. I know I'm not. I'm just tired of being here. I feel like I'm in prison. This is a prison, basically. And I'm sick of being here. I'm just trying to awaken you guys to realize who you all are. And... Try to make things better on this earth, and y'all want to come and guess me. Y'all want to call me names. Y'all don't want to watch my videos no more. But y'all listen to people that's telling you lies. Y'all watch people that's telling you they talk to God every day. Y'all watch people that ask you for money all the time on their channel. It don't hurt to ask for money. But it's just the fact that, you know, a lot of people are taking advantage of it. They're not telling y'all no truth and they're asking y'all for money. That's the, that's what I'm getting, trying to get y'all to understand. They These people out there, a lot of them is lying to you and they're asking for money. That's what I'm trying to get y'all to understand. they tricking y'all into for you to pay them money by giving, giving you lies about the Bible and everything else. And people like me are telling you the truth and me get nothing. We get no support or anything. That's what I'm trying to get y'all to understand. Because like I said, if I'm false, why am I still having these dreams? Why am I still seeing supernatural things happen? Why? And I'm not a Christian. That's what I'm trying to get y'all to understand. So, I love you all. I'm not trying to make this video long. Y'all just need to really think about this stuff. The things that I talk about, I'm not lying to you. Y'all just not on the same level as me. That's why y'all say I'm crazy or this and that. Or I don't know what I'm talking about because you're not on the same level as I am. So, yeah, you're going to think I'm crazy because you're still on a third dimensional level as far as what they taught you when you were growing up. You're still on that same level. You're in the box. So, yes, of course you're going to think... What I'm saying is foolish or it's nonsense because you were never taught that by the government or your schools. So you're not going to believe me because I'm not a teacher or I'm not a scientist, which they're all just fake anyway. They're not telling you any type of truth. They're not teaching you anything. So, yeah, you're going to believe them, though, because that's what you were taught you know, to, to, to um, listen to, basically. And your parents, they listen to them. So they're teaching you false things as well, but they don't know that it's not their fault. They were brought up in the system. Everybody has been brought up into the system. And only so few is going to awaken. Just like the Bible speaks of about certain few people awakening. That's what the Bible is talking about. It's not talking about no Christians. It's not talking about no Buddhism and all the other stuff. Certain people awakening. 144,000. It's not talking about them people. It's not talking about no religion. Because if you think about it. The um. Where did he just go? If you think about it. The Most High God, or whatever you want to call it, never had no religion. You got all these religions, but he never had a religion. Why y'all join a religion, and he never had a religion? He just came here to tell y'all the truth, and that was it. If that story is true. Chucky?
They just staring at each other. Chucky. Why y'all just staring at each other for? Normally you'll go over there and bark at a dog and then come back. What are you doing, Chucky? Chucky. Chucky.